weirdest thing for me is just saying this is my office. I, I mean, I my father was a pastor, and <laughs> I remember his offices. They were warm. They were couches. They were all these things, and this is where I am. The Reverend Jeffrey Bross has a reputation for thinking outside the box. Thanks. <laughs> you excited? In 2007, he started Flowing Grace, a portable church in a box affiliated with Batavia United Methodist near Chicago. In 2013, Bross moved his office out of the church to a place with plenty of boxes, a storage facility. These units are filled with people in transition and who are hurting, uh, going through divorce, uh, lost a home. This unit here um, is the woman that I met who is running away from an abusive relationship with a couple of kids and uh, she's stuck in a one bedroom apartment uh, but didn't want her things to go away and her children's things and the memories and the books and, and whatnot. A lot of stuffed animals if they have kids, teddy bears. Flowing Grace Church member Joanne Mendocino told Bross about her own experience here and the idea was born. Due to the death of my father, my mom came to live with us and we had to move their stuff someplace. And so I met Mark and we had a storage facility here. So storage? Yes. There's a lot of heartache and a lot of, a lot of issues going on here. And I can hand them their card and say, you know, call uh, P Pastor Jeffrey Bross and he can talk to you if you would like and maybe he can help you. I just don't even know how to almost put it into words how important a pastor is. He's someone, he's a brother, he's a father, he's uh, someone to listen to. Um, he can be just about anything. I mean, it's, uh, it's amazing what they do. Bross admits the transient nature of the storage business makes a long-term relationship difficult, but thinks people will remember a helping hand in their time of crisis. As you're talking to folks, pretty soon their number might be disconnected or they're gone, uh, and as quickly as they come in, they can go out. Um, and so it may never grow our church because of that, but if it gave them hope to hold through, and then they could say later on, hey, the church was there for me, uh, that might help. The whole idea with Flowing Grace was to go out and talk with the community and be in the community. Um, and this really afforded Pastor Brass the opportunity to do those things. We're trying to find a whole bunch of different places to meet with folks. Now this has really inspired us to think outside the box, as it were, as I'm driving in my box. Uh, but right here is a laundromat that we're gonna start to have various Bible studies there. There are hurting people and people in need and people questioning and people doubting everywhere. This used to be my office uh, when I was the pastor uh, just at Batavia United Methodist Church. The challenges of, of reaching out to new folks, uh, it's much more difficult when you have an older building and you know the old saying, here's the church, here's the steeple, open the doors, see all the people. Our belief is here's the church, here's the steeple, open the doors, now go out and serve and reach out to the people. And so that's what Flowing Grace is meant to do, is to reach out, to do something about our faith, uh, and share the love of Christ. This video was brought to you by the people of the United Methodist Church through world service donations.